welcome to TUMU. Here we have Professor Dr. Hafiz, PhD on Quranic Archaeology. He has vast experience around of 30 years that includes 70, 7 years of foreign experiences. He has worked in Metli University, Ethiopia and even in Saudi Arabia. He was a manager of uh, some group of industries in Mathura even and he is a writer of five international democratic ideas here he is Dr. Hafiz. So today we are going to, today we, are, we will request Dr. Hafiz to highlight the QMU. Here we have Dr. Hafiz. As a close citizen, I would like to wish to all my future close citizen friends, what is meant by QMU? We know very well Q for Quran, M for Modern, and U for University. Quran, Modern, University. What's needed? Q, M, today. We know thousands of universities and research institutes throughout the world now existing today. Almost most of the universities are trying to solve the problems of the world. Of the poor nations as well as rich nations, even middle class based nations like ours, India. But we know very well that all these research institutes and academic management institution or organization, almost somehow, somewhere, they have failed to solve the problems of today's world. And problems are being cropped up day to day. Why? We know very well what my research has found that universities are not connected with the supreme intelligent creator of mankind. What's highlighted in the Quran? Quran is highlighted. Humanity must have a relationship with the supreme intelligent creator, what in Arabic language we say Allah. And other languages also, other names are there. So that's why Quran is, Quran is highlighting not only the concept of theology, but also the departments at the present time in modern universities, almost all the departments, not only uh, astronomy, I mean astrophysics like this book, we can say that Quran for astronomy and earth exploration from space. I mean, how Quran is indicating about the astronomical words that's highlighted in this book. And we know very well, even NASA, the published astronomy, and even about Jean, Jean Fiasco, that also some were indicated in the Quran. So this genetics and Jean, so where's the relationship? Even we know very well that embryology, it's one of the modern and leading uh, department of the present world. This embryology concept also is mentioned in the Quran. In this way, we know very well the Prophet Muhammad, who, who was given a title of Prophethood in 610 around and up to 632, this 22 years in Mecca and Medina of present Kingdom of Saudi Arab. In 7th century, the Supreme Intelligent Creator, he sent almost all the departmental instructions in the Quran. So today, Quran may be uh, the guidebook for the modern departments and Quran is not only giving the solution to the present world problems but it's going to connect with our intelligent creator so there's a need at the present time a relationship between our creator and the present world as we know that various kinds of activities are being done every day by different departmental professionals. So we, we have to think that how we can develop Quran Modern University in future. And we are going to create glossy zen, this citizenship. We have to, uh, what I do feel that in state of citizen, uh, we have to introduce glossism. I mean, a person is to think not only about the locality, 
but also global aspects. So a person in future uh, is to be identified as a glossizane, which is the, one of the goal of Q mu. I mean, more than 7 billion uh, humans today at the present, more than 220 nations. So we have to solve almost all the problems today from the Quran, as well as Muslims, around 2 billion, they have to think of the modern words. And our non-Muslim brothers, sisters, they need the Quranic instructions. So how we have to correlate Quran and the modern departments of modern universities, that is the challenge. But we are trying to solve and we have developed a lot of books. We have collected from all over the world, around 30 to 35 departments, and that is to be many explained in detail in near future. I hope that the <clears throat> near future is to be uh, a very progressive future, a peaceful future, that uh, our glucisins are to solve almost all the problems of the present world. Thank you. Today, it's a very brief description about QMU. In future, we are going to discuss more in detail about QMU's uh, <clears throat> department-wise we have to discuss and we, inshallah, we have to set up Quran Modern University and for this university we need the cooperation, the help, not only from modern professionals but also from Quranic personalities who have very good experience in the Quran as well as modern departments. So we need a solution for the present problems. And I hope that we are going to create a peaceful and progressive world in the near future. Thank you. Jazakallah khair, sir, for giving your valuable time. Thank you so much.